amazed about um, the amount of uh, threats that are continuously coming um, towards uh, some major companies and, and government organizations and individuals throughout the U.S. And so when there is something uh, that's uh, that's happened, uh, we, we oftentimes will work with our, our customers, we'll work with uh, oftentimes the government and various government organizations to ensure that, uh, that that's addressed in any way that we can support. For all our listeners out there that are considering um, buying cloud services, do yourself a favor. Just go buy Azure. Let me just be blunt, Ramel. Thank, thank you for the plug. <laughs> thank yeah. you. Yeah. Nobody else is doing it like these guys. It's incredible stuff. So just trust me on this one. Get yourself Azure, okay? Yep, yep. No, let, let me just throw in Office 365. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you uh, so, sell, sell. Yeah, you know. Uh, so no, that's that's good. Yeah. I mean, we we really do believe that. And so um, when we think about our data, even when it goes to our data our, our data centers. So yeah, uh, I know. Uh, our data centers are really super secure as well. Physical, uh, physical security as well as uh, cybersecurity surrounding each one of those centers. And so, I mean, we believe that at the heart of where your data is stored to where it is, like physically stored to where it is online and how you're communicating that in cyberspace. Well, Romel, we want to thank you for coming on. And we also want to make sure that people have an opportunity to find you online, social media. I mean, I've been checking out your social media. I know you got an Instagram thing. Going, <laughs> so uh, if you want to share any of that data with our listeners, it'd be great. Yeah, yeah. So you can follow me. So I've been on uh, on in- Instagram, IG. Uh, <laughs> you know. Uh, for the gram. You're doing it for the yeah, gram. Yeah, I'm doing yeah. it for the gram. Uh, for now, about a month. So if you want to be like my 100th uh, follower, <laughs> please join me. I uh, would love the, the conversation. So it's uh, at really Ramel, really Ramel. How you spell Ramel? R A A M E L. So it's uh, at really Ramel. R A A M E L. I don't think there are that many. By the time you do really an R, <laughs> that's 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 gonna be me. So seriously, I mean. Um, it's it's been great here having this conversation. We love to connect. I love having these conversations around innovation and what's happening and and entrepreneurs and uh, what's happening in education and around uh, the the startup ecosystem in Dallas and across the the U S. And so, uh, if if you guys are out there, please ping me uh, or, or reach out to Sean or Ryan and and uh, we'd love to to chat sometime. And guys, anytime you're um, you, you want to come back out to campus, let me let me know. Uh, yeah, I see some is, basketball great. course out there, a little soccer. So maybe yeah, we have the putting green nice. popping off. Yeah. So we might have to do a little bit of that, and uh, before you guys head out. So well, thanks, man. We, it's, you know, Ryan and I both have worked with you in different capacities over the years, and you know, personally, it's been great watching your career, watching you grow. So uh, glad that we had an opportunity to introduce our audience to you and everybody to make sure you follow Ramel. Uh, join us back after the break. This is Deconstructing Dallas. We'll be right back after this break. Trimble, Sean Williams. Sean, what a great, great interview with our good friend Ramel Mitchell. That guy is super dynamic, isn't he? It's a, a great interview and just a great campus. There's so much going on. Um, and they're so involved with getting kids involved in STEM. They're, you know, like you said, saving the world as it relates to cybersecurity. Yeah. You know, they're helping us have fun with their consoles and Xbox. Yeah, and I mean, it's 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 a it's, they're they're involved in so many different things related to technology. That's right. And the good thing is, with so much action on campus, they even helped you get your steps in yesterday because we had to park literally in the last spot in the parking lot about. 
Uh, half a mile from where we were supposed to be. Yeah, I got about half of my steps in just at Microsoft, which is cool. And it's, you know, it's good that we were with the campus director because he was like (laughs) ducking in and out of all the buildings and let's go in this room. And we we were, it was great that we could, we could record in a, in a studio that was actually built for, for recording. That was right. That was great. Sean, the Aggies are playing this weekend. Yeah, we got a spring game. SMU has spring game, but I do want to give a shout out to my colleague, Aaron Ragsdale, who is going down for the spring game. She's headed down to work with our client on the Texas A&M Hotel and Conference Center, and she is bailing me out so I can do some more work here with the Women's Leadership Summit. So again, shout out to Aaron Ragsdale. And I heard Aaron say in talking to another good Aggie that this will at least be a game that uh, Coach Fisher will not lose <laughs> the spring game. So we are guaranteed to win here in the spring game for A&M. And then SMU's got a game too. That's right. Uh, I believe it's 11 a.m. Uh, Gerald J. Ford Stadium, the Sunny Dykes era begins on the hilltop. So pony up and uh, call our guy Kyle Nason if you need some season tickets. All right. A couple of good games from our clients. It'll be awesome. Thanks to everyone for tuning in. Thanks to Ramel Mitchell for his time joining us on the podcast, taking us around the Microsoft campus. Thanks to Jennifer Pascal. Thanks to Mary Woodleaf. Again, thanks to all our listeners. Check us out on SoundCloud, on iTunes, wherever you get your podcast. Check out our new logo. We will be back next week. Adios. Adios.